Welcome to today's top tech news from TechSeed. Apple has just announced Apple Intelligence. It's a revamped Siri incorporating ChatGPT through a partnership with OpenAI. The company prioritizes practical features like writing suggestions and custom emojis over flashy innovations. The Wall Street Journal reports that Apple is also in talks with Meta for a similar AI partnership. In other news, TikTok shop has also rapidly gained popularity among Gen Z adults in the US, now tied with Instagram as the top social app for purchases among 18 to 23 year olds, according to Morning Consult. Menen Millennials and older Gen Z users, that's 18 to 26, are the most active buyers in TikTok shop, outspending both younger Gen Zers and Gen Xers. This is a very interesting report on projections about TV. It's a New York Times interview with executives from Netflix, Amazon Prime Video, and IAC that predicted a shift towards profitability in streaming, involving more ads, higher prices for ad-free tiers, and fewer prestige TV projects. Sisipad is an Indonesian logistics powerhouse that just appointed Philippe, former CEO of Lazada Logistics Indonesia, as the CEO. COO. Philippe has extensive experience in Indonesia's logistic landscape and he succeeds Barwanto, who had been CEO since 2014. This marks a significant leadership change at Saipat. The Chinese insurtech giant Huzi has acquired Vietnamese startup Global Care through its international arm Pony Insurtech, aiming to expand in Southeast Asia's growing digital insurance market. And finally, Daryl Han has a very interesting article that's discussing the rise of Gen Z consumerism and its impact on the travel industry. He highlights how travel has become a top priority for younger generations with a McKinsey service showing increased interest post-pandemic, especially among Gen Zs and Millennials. That's it for today's Top Tech News. If you enjoyed this, subscribe to our YouTube channel so we can keep bringing you Top Tech News from Southeast Asia.